Hello guys, today I want to present you a website, not my website, not our website, it's just I found last week templates of database schemas. It was actually launched only last week and it's by DrawSQL. I'm not affiliated with them by any means, but it's a great tool to understand the database structures with examples. Because number one question that I see on Laracast and in my own emails and YouTube is how to structure the database, the relationships that belongs to, belongs to many, polymorphic, whatever. This is the most difficult part of creating new project, even with our quick admin panel, actually. We have admin panel generator, but quite often the question on support that we get is how to structure things. So before creating the actual project, the code, in your head or on paper, you should have some kind of vision for the structure for the database. So this project, DrawSQL Templates, is a great set of examples. And not only that, it has examples from a lot of Laravel projects specifically, very popular projects. So this is the whole list. And if you click on Laravel, you can filter by Laravel. And let's take a look, for example, at Voyager. Let's open that in new tab. It's loading the schema and it's loading the diagram inside as an iframe or something similar. And you can click on full screen and now it's actually readable. And you can zoom in and zoom out, but this is the screen where you can actually see the relationships. And this view of database with relationships is extremely powerful to understand what the project is about. So this is the user enroll section, translations are separately, data types are separately, and this is about menus and this is about settings. Even from that, it's possible to scope the project to feel how much is inside of it. Let's open another example. Laravel Spark is also a really popular system. So it looks like this. Also not a big database schema. Also there are packages, for example, Cashier or Laravel Permission is a good one. So Laravel Permission looks like this. And this view would help you to understand how the package works actually. And beside that, there are big projects. So I've saved a few, Snipe IT, Asset Management System. Look at that. By default, it is zoomed at 12% only. So even if you go full screen on my MacBook, it's not readable. So it's a huge database. Well, not huge, but quite a big one. And you can learn from that even more. And similar to this one, I recommend Attendize for event management system and ticketing. Also at 12% zoom by default. And a full screen, it's also not that readable, but you can zoom, zoom in and then wander around the database and zoom at your particular area that you're interested in. So this is available for free at drawsql.app slash templates. And this is from business point of view is a great way to showcase your project because while navigating those databases, you would probably think, huh, I can create something like that. And then you can go to DrawSQL homepage and see what the tool is about, see pricing, see features, and maybe become a customer. So this is a lesson for me as well, how to showcase my own projects like courses or quick admin panel, showcase with results, with visual demos, and then people would get interested in your product. So check out those database templates at drawsql.app and see you guys in other videos.